What's up, everyone? This is Matt Hafey from Tripping for Alt Press. We're talking about the 10 things that people didn't know about me. I mean, with me being this socially present, I would imagine everyone knows everything, but let me let me really dig down and we're gonna, we're gonna figure this out together. I don't know if everyone knows this, but I wasn't the original singer of Trivium. There was originally a singer named Brad. Um, he was the first singer in the band, so we'll leave that as number one. Number two, there was actually another rhythm guitar player before me who I believe left the band before they even ever did a single practice. His name was also Matt. He was also very tall, actually taller than me. Um, but yeah, there was another guitar player before me and they never practiced with them. Three, people usually think it was the seventh grade performance of self-esteem that got me the try for Trivium, but it was actually my eighth grade performance of No Leaf Clover. And it was just me and a drummer. I don't know if many people knew that. It was me and a drummer named Chris who played No Leaf Clover. And I was immediately asked afterwards by my friend who was in my grade. She said, my older brother wants to see if you want to try for his band. Trivium was like three to four years older than me. I was in eighth grade. They were all in high school. Or there's actually a bunch of songs by us that no one's ever heard. We released Ab Initio, which is the re-release of Ember to Inferno, the blue demo, the red demo, the yellow demo. But there's actually a whole bunch of other stuff that we recorded at Full Sail Live back when Full Sail, not first started, but kind of was, wasn't what it is today, the place we did our new record at. Um, and I believe there's a, a lot of songs that we haven't played for anyone. Uh, there's a song called Blitzkrieg. I got the title, obviously, from Metallica covering someone else, but it's not that song. There's a song called War. A bunch of other stuff. I think there's at least like three or four or five other songs. Yeah. Five. I don't know if you know this or not, but I was the singer of a technical death metal band called Caphronome that a lot of tech death and death metal bands actually love to this day. Caphronome, C-A-P-H-A-R-N-A-U-M. What's even cooler about that band, you can't find the music anywhere. You can't find the CDs. It's not on any streaming services, so good luck finding that one, but it's pretty sick. I'm 16 and some of the best screams I ever did in my entire career. It's me, Jason Sukoff, the guitar player of Martyr, the bass player of Monstrosity, and Jason's brother on drums. Six, you should know this, but my favorite Final Fantasy games in order are seven, six, four, and then nine. You should know that. I don't know if you know this about me, but I used to be a Pharah main on Overwatch, then a May main, and I am now a Junkrat main. If you watch my stream, you understand. If you don't play games, then you don't understand. Eight. Eight things you didn't know about me. I really put it all out there at all times. There were more guitar players in between and around the time before we ever went on our first tour, which sure, local band at, at times, but um, before Corey, we had the guitar player of the Autumn Offering who filled in for like a couple of shows, who's in our band for a week, but he played like two or three local shows with us. The guitar player of Mindscar, the lead singer of Mindscar, Richie, who I've been friends with since I was about 15 or 16, he's the one that got me into black metal. Um, he was our bass player for a couple shows when he had dreadlocks. I don't think he played rhythm guitar for us, though. Um, the bass player Monstrosity filled on bass for us on a tour before we got Apollo. My friend from high school named Al filled in for Travis at my birthday party when I was 13 or 14 years old. So there have been a lot of people who play with their band. But yeah, I know people are always like, oh, you guys have had X amount of people. There's been a lot more. There's always more on the local level. Nine. My facial hair is actually red. You only learn that now from this video because I've got quarantine beard, but me being 51% Japanese, according to 23andMe, my beard represents the 33% Irish. I'm actually a third Irish, and you can definitely see it right now. You can definitely see that. Nine things. Ten things I didn't know about you. When our guitar tech, Ken, who is now the guitar player for Obituary, who was the guitar player for Andrew WK, guitar tech for Mastodon, guitar tech for us, his earliest recollection of ever meeting me, which is false, he thought that I had pink capri pants on and a white belt. I'm not kidding you at all. You can ask him. Ask Ken from Obituary, what do you remember Matt Hafey as is your first memory from OzFest 2005? I don't know why he thought that. I mean, I think I would rock that outfit pretty well. But that's the 10th thing in Ken Andrews' memory. That's what he thought he first met me in. 
10 things I didn't know about Matt Hafey, unless you did know them. The last thing you definitely did not know. 